the South Korean military operates about 400 km 900. It is one of the most popular world APCs of the Korean army today. The vehicle was built under license from the Fiat 6614. Production started in 1977 at Asia Motors and stopped in 1985. This is a simpler and reliable 4x4 APC with a weight of about 8.5 tons, a length of 5.86 meters, a width of 2.5 meters, and a height of 1.78 meters. The KM900 is designed for military and paramilitary operations, where some form of mobile armor protection is required. The South Korean army uses these armor vehicles for defense of rear areas, protection of convoys, and so on. Due to their limited armor protection and cross-country mobility, the KM900 series armor vehicles were not designed to operate in the forward areas. For the essentials, the prismatic hull is made of welded steel armor, providing early basic protection against small arms fire and artillery cell splinters on all angles. The crew of 10 to 12 comprise a driver seated at the front left alongside the right side engine compartment and transmission, while the commander is seated behind in a cupola. Placed in the center, it has a swinging arm for the 12.7mm heavy machine gun or 7.62mm machine gun. Behind is located the tube compartment for 8 to 10 men seated on floating benches, which can fire on the move thanks to the pistol pulse with vision blocks and exit the vehicle via a rear powered ram. In addition, there is a left side door and two roof hatches. For mobility, the KM900 relies on an Iveco model 806-24 delivering 160 horsepower. It can reach a top speed of 100 km per hour on road, 4.5 km per hour when screaming, and an operational range of 700 km. Indeed, the KM900 is fully amphibious without preparation, and propulsion is provided by road wheels. The chassis comprised a full-time all-wheel drive. Equipment does not include a central inflation system. However, but the tires are of the run flat top. It could climb a gradient 60%, side slope 30%, vertical step 0.4 meters, and gap adjunct 0.5 meters wide. During its operational history, the figure was improved and the Koreans introduced their own variant, called the KM901. Its versions include armor ambulance, models, and command vehicles. Currently, the KM900 is not really suitable for the battlefield, but is more suitable for police operations around Seoul. It is likely that both the KM900 and KM901 will soon be replaced by the new K806 armor personnel carrier, which has much better performance. Mm -hmm. 
my video about the KM 900 APC answer. Thank you for watching. If you find this video interesting, please give me your thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to support the channel. Goodbye and see you again in the next videos. Tạm biệt và hẹn gặp lại quý vị và các bạn trong các video tiếp theo.